Ever wondered what it's like to live like a music legend? Today we're diving into the luxurious life of the iconic Smokey Robinson. From his impressive net worth to his collection of luxury cars and breathtaking mansions, we'll explore how his extraordinary career has translated into a life of opulence and elegance. Let's get started. Smokey Robinson, a giant in American music, has made a lasting impact as an RB and pop singer, songwriter, record producer, and former record executive. With a net worth of $150 million, Robinson is renowned for pioneering the iconic Motown sound, helping shape the music scene from the 1950s through the 1970s. He first gained fame as a key member of the Miracles, a vocal group that achieved significant success during the Motown era. After leaving the Miracles, Robinson embarked on a fruitful solo career and played a crucial role in the industry as the vice president of Motown Records. His contributions to music were formally recognized in 1987 when he was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. William Smokey Robinson Jr. was born on February 19, 1940 in Detroit, Michigan. Growing up in a financially struggling household, young William found solace and inspiration in music. His famous nickname, Smokey, originated from his uncle Claude, who affectionately called him Smokey Joe. As he grew older, he simplified it to just Smokey, a name that would become legendary in the music world. During his high school years, Smokey's passion for music blossomed. He formed a doo-wop group named The Five Chimes, showcasing his early dedication and love for music. This group evolved into the Matadors, marking the beginning of Smokey's journey in the music industry. In the late 1950s, the Matadors rebranded themselves as the Miracles, a name change that marked the beginning of an era that would soon reshape American music. In 1957, Smokey met Barry Gordy, a talented songwriter. This meeting proved to be a game changer for the Miracles. Gordy's guidance led to the release of their first single, got a job which quickly found success. This prompted Smokey to leave college and fully commit to his music career. Under Gordy's new label, Motown Records, the Miracles continued their rise to fame. In 1960, they released Shop Around a groundbreaking single that sold over a million copies. The 1960s were a golden decade for the Miracles, with hit singles like You've Really Got a Hold On Me, Mickey's Monkey Eye Second, That Emotion, and The Tears of a Clown Smokey was at the heart of this success, serving as the lead singer, principal songwriter, and producer. By 1969, Smokey was worn out from relentless touring and expressed a desire to retire. However, the success of Tears of a Clown persuaded him to stay with the Miracles until 1972. After parting ways with the group, Smokey embarked on a solo career, releasing albums that showcased his distinctive voice and songwriting prowess. In 1975, Smokey released a quiet storm an album that became a landmark in his career, featuring hits like Baby, That's Back At ya. And the titular track, Quiet Storm, this album helped define a new genre of RB characterized by its smooth, soulful sound. Despite his focus shifting to his executive role at Motown, Smokey made a remarkable comeback in 1979 with the single Cruisin' and continued his momentum with hits like Being With You. Smokey Robinson's net worth is estimated at $150 million, and his real estate portfolio is equally impressive. His historic colonial estate in Los Angeles and his Cape Cod-style mansion in Malibu showcase his keen eye for luxury. Both properties exude elegance and charm, offering breathtaking views and opulent amenities. Let's start with his historic colonial estate in Los Angeles. Nestled in Encino, a quaint suburb of Los Angeles, stands a historic colonial estate that exudes charm and significance. Originally constructed in 1882 amidst the bustling streets of downtown Los Angeles, this architectural gem found its new home in the 1920s, moving gracefully to its current location. Its exterior is a testament to timeless elegance, featuring grand columns, graceful balconies, and shuttered windows that overlook meticulously manicured gardens and a sprawling two-acre property. Stepping inside, one is immediately struck by the preserved beauty of a bygone era. The interior showcases intricate moldings and paneling that speak to the craftsmanship of its origins, a formal dining room beckons with French doors opening onto a serene terrace, while a cozy living room boasts a welcoming fireplace perfect for intimate gatherings. A sunlit sunroom invites relaxation with its expansive windows offering views of the lush surroundings. The heart of the home, the kitchen, blends modern convenience with classic style, featuring a spacious layout, 
a breakfast bar for casual dining, and a charming nook for more intimate meals. Even the bathrooms are adorned with luxurious touches, including unexpected delights like fireplaces and tufted ceilings, adding a touch of opulence to everyday routines. The estate generously accommodates five bedrooms, including a master suite fit for royalty, complete with a private living room, sauna, and a patio overlooking the verdant landscape. For entertainment, a cinema room awaits movie enthusiasts, while a dedicated wine tasting area and a gym cater to refined tastes and fitness needs alike. Beyond its walls, the property unfolds like a tranquil oasis with winding stone paths that meander through manicured gardens leading to a refreshing swimming pool and a guest house offering privacy and comfort. A covered dining pavilion promises delightful alfresco dining experiences, perfect for entertaining guests against the backdrop of this historic estate. For those enamored with its history and charm, this estate has not only captivated the senses but also attracted attention on the market. With a listing price of $3.6 million, it stands as a testament to both its historical significance and its appeal as a modern-day sanctuary. Next, let's take a look at Smokey's Mansion in Malibu. Smokey Robinson made a savvy investment when he purchased this impressive house in early 2020 for around $6 million. Just a few years later, its value has soared to an estimated $9 million, showcasing his keen eye for real estate opportunities. Situated in the coveted West Malibu area, this expansive estate spans 5,815 square feet, as per property tax records. The property is nestled on a double lot, ensuring ample space and privacy. Its Cape Cod-style architecture is complemented by sprawling decks and patios that offer breathtaking views of the ocean, making it a serene retreat. Upon entering, the residence boasts four living rooms and as many bathrooms, ideal for both relaxation and entertaining guests. The interior features wooden floors throughout, enhancing its warm and inviting atmosphere. Skylights and large windows flood the space with natural light, accentuating the open-plan design. The heart of the home is the oceanfront living room, a two-story space with a cozy fireplace and a bay window overlooking the sea. Adjacent to this is a gourmet kitchen equipped with top-of-the-line appliances, a glass-topped island, and a butler's pantry. The dining area is strategically positioned to offer stunning ocean views, creating an idyllic setting for meals. Upstairs, the master suite exudes luxury with its ocean view sitting area, walk-in closet, safe, and a beautifully tiled bath featuring a freestanding tub. Two additional bedrooms on this level each boast bay windows with built-in seating, and one even includes a loft space accessible by stairs. Entertainment options abound within the house including a spacious home theater on the lower level with soundproofing and a built-in screen. For fitness enthusiasts, a private gym studio with built-in cabinetry and access to an outdoor shower awaits, providing a perfect retreat for exercise and relaxation. Outside, the property features a wraparound wooden deck that leads to a private yard with a hot tub, offering a serene escape. Additional highlights include a separate guest house studio office with high wood panel ceilings and great views, ensuring ample space for work or relaxation away from the main residence. Practical amenities such as air conditioning, central vacuum, and a security system add to the property's appeal, while impressive gardens with waterfalls, a koi pond, and meandering paths enhance its natural beauty. A direct access to the beach further enhances the allure of this remarkable estate. Smokey's love for luxury extends to his car collection, which includes approximately six different vehicles. One standout addition is the Cadillac Escalade ESV Luxury, a recent purchase valued at $95,000. This spacious SUV offers top-tier comfort and style, featuring a powerful V8 engine and state-of-the-art entertainment systems. With its sleek design and plush interior, the Escalade ESV Luxury epitomizes both elegance and functionality, making it a fitting choice for Robinson's impressive collection. Beyond his musical talents, Smokey is also known for his philanthropy. Having donated an estimated $2 million to charity over the past three decades, Smokey Robinson is involved in several charitable efforts reflecting his commitment to giving back. One notable initiative is his support for the United Negro College Fund UNCF, which provides scholarships and financial assistance to minority students attending historically black colleges and universities HBCCC. Robinson has been a longtime advocate for education and empowerment within the African-American community, 
and his contributions to the UNCF have helped many students pursue higher education opportunities. Additionally, he has participated in various benefit concerts and events to raise funds for causes related to education, health, and community development. Smokey's personal life has seen both triumphs and challenges. In 1959, he married Claudette Rogers, his fellow Miracles member. Together, they welcomed two children, Barry Robinson and Tamla Robinson. Barry's name honored Motown's founder, Barry Gordy, while Tamla paid homage to the original Tamla label that later evolved into Motown. Despite their union, Robinson's marriage was not without turmoil. He openly admitted to having multiple affairs during his time with Claudette, including a notable relationship with Diana Ross. This strained his marriage, leading to a divorce in 1986. Smokey later married Frances Gladney in 2002, and they reside in Pittsburgh, where they also operate a winery. Smokey has maintained certain personal habits throughout his life, such as abstaining from red meat since 1972, and practicing transcendental meditation. He attributes his striking golden green eyes to his French great-grandmother. Smokey Robinson's enduring influence in music is evident in his role as the owner and host of the Sirius XM channel Soul Town. Starting in November 2023, the channel, known as Smokey's Soul Town, celebrates RB and soul classics from the 1950s to the early 1980s. Robinson occasionally appears on the channel sharing stories of his Motown days and selecting his favorite tracks from that era. His journey from Motown legend to Sirius XM host continues to captivate audiences, reflecting his enduring impact on the world of soul music. At 84 years old, Smokey Robinson remains a cherished and influential figure in music. His body of work spans decades, and his contributions have left an indelible mark on the industry. In 2023, Robinson announced his first album in nearly a decade, titled GMS set to release in April. The album promises nine tracks of new music, with the lead single If We Don't Have Each Other already available on streaming services since January 2023. This announcement was met with excitement and anticipation, highlighting Robinson's lasting impact on the music world. Thank you for joining us on this deep dive into the luxurious life of Smokey Robinson. From his early days as a Motown sensation to becoming a timeless symbol of success, Smokey's extraordinary career has translated into a life of opulence and elegance. His journey from Motown legend to solo artist and philanthropist continues to captivate audiences. If you enjoyed this video, leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next video.